A 20-year-old Brownsburg man is charged in a terrorism case, and he could spend the next 20 years of his life in prison. His lawyer says he will ask for mercy and leniency after pleading guilty today in federal court. Our David McAnally found a community relieved as his defense team claims this man is not a terrorist. Wednesday night, calm and quiet at the Brownsburg apartment complex, but almost exactly two years ago. I just saw the FBI out there and I was kind of like wondering. The FBI agents walking through this parking lot here were focused on one particular apartment, one particular family, one particular 18-year-old. Remember, here's what it looked like. We didn't know what was happening at all, so it was kind of scary. Her then neighbor, Akram Musla, arrested on terrorism charges. Wednesday in federal court in Indianapolis, he pleaded guilty to one count. Relief for some we spoke with. It's Indiana, so it was really shocking that something like this would happen. Can we speak with you? No, no. No comments? No. Muslim supporters leaving the courthouse Wednesday. From his lawyer? He's not the same person today that was brainwashed by ISIS several years ago. On his arrest in 2016, prosecutor says Musla made multiple attempts to fly overseas to link up with ISIS. He was also allegedly shot for supplies for a pressure cooker bomb, posted ISIS videos on social media, and posed with an ISIS flag. But his lawyer says... He is not a terrorist under any stretch of the imagination. He's, he's provided... He's admitted that he provided material support in the sense that he himself was going to go overseas. He says Musla was from a broken home, bored, and wanted to be part of something. Back at the Brownsburg Park where Musla allegedly tried to recruit others for ISIS. I was like, man, that's pretty crazy. High schoolers who remember the scare two years ago remember something else that came out of it. They like warned about us at the dinner table. Your families? Yeah. What'd they tell you? They are just like, stay away from strangers and, you know, people that come out of the woods and try to get you to join ISIS. The U.S. attorney said uh, they won't comment on this until after sentencing. And there's no date yet for that sentencing? Not yet. Still waiting. Again, the penalty could be 20 years. All right. Thank you, David.